guys so it's Saturday it's day six. six day seven day six it's day six of no it's day five six seven day six. Like last Monday today Saturday it's day six no babe Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday six days we've been in the only six days Sunday Monday supposed to be the seventh day Monday's our first day we got here. Yeah. And so Monday start counts as one day. All right. It's day six. We've got seven nights here. Okay, right. So it's day six of our stay in Diani. Diani. And today we are having dinner at the Anchors restaurant. Serenity Resort, I think it's called. It's Serenity. Resort. Serenity Resort, yeah. Serenity Anchors Resort. At we're gonna find out what it's actually called and tell you guys maybe put it somewhere on the screen but as the name suggests this place is so serene beautiful. so beautiful it's actually very quiet it's in the evening I think we have the restaurant mostly to ourselves I don't see any other patients need to have a dinner later probably yeah maybe just get fired up. Mm, it's a smaller place than the resort that we are staying at but it looks relatively nicer, actually. Actually, is it? It's, it's a little bit more boutique. Yeah. yeah, and quiet. Also, we noticed they fenced off. Um, they fenced off part of. I don't. You guys can't see. Oh no, you can see. Can you see? Can you guys see that fence over there? It's an electric fence to separate the resort. The hotel the restaurant whatever this is from the beach and that's just for privacy and security I think that's really good our resort doesn't really have that but maybe our security is just better so if you're one of those people who wonder oh what if people come invaders come from the sea the ocean area or the beach area into the into the resort maybe this is one place that you might want to try out if you're really worried about your security but I really love it I think it's Great, I think it's really nice. What do you think? It's good, yeah. Yeah. It's good look, yeah. Yeah. It's a lovely place. It is. I like it. Okay, so we're just waiting for our dinner. Eamon um, ordered for a lobster. That's gonna take a while to cook. So we're waiting for the starters. Hopefully, it's gonna be something nice. And they offered us bread. I think that's really nice. <laughs> what? I'm hungry. It is. It is right. Nice. Yeah. yeah, I said uh, because your food is gonna take longer, we're gonna offer you guys bread. And since I'm having stomach issues, I'm having my drink as dawa, it's just ginger tea, ginger lemon tea, mm -hmm. ginger honey oh. lemon. And yeah. Eamon's having a mango juice. When the food gets here, I'll show you guys. And if it's good, we're gonna give an honest review. So if you want to try this place out, you know, you won't be shy, you'll know what to expect. I hope it's gonna be good. Is it so far, so good. So far, so good. It's yeah, true. It's really nice. Yeah. It's just a, a very short distance from the main road. Near the, t it's quite near the. It's like a food plus. It's yeah. Very close to there. Yeah. So if the, if the tuk tuk driver tells you three hundred bob, say no. It's too much. <laughs> Don't get tripped off. Oh yeah. You know where to the west. It's me who made you. food is here and all oh my days this looks so delicious so mine is a chicken curry I don't remember what the actual curry name was it has a fancy name but it looks good that's all that matters and some naan bread on the side and I'm gonna have that with white rice and this is lobster that's a lobster and what's that um salad 
and I don't remember what that potato thing is on the side that looks like a curry but it's a potato thing this all looks so delicious guys so we're gonna have our dinner and then later on we'll give you guys a review of what we think of the food My company at dinner. Oh, can you bring it back a bit? It's too bright. It's my company at dinner. And we just had the lobster, potato gratin, buttered chicken, rice, and papadam, and social media addict. Right there. Good morning, guys. It's the last day. It's the day before we leave Diani. That's basically the last day of our stay in Diani. I'm alone. If you see a little foot over there, that's nobody. <laughs> Do you not want to make an appearance? Oh. What? He's here. Hi. Still here. Just, yeah, hi. It's me. <laughs> it's me. <laughs> Okay, so today we've spent the day, the morning, just basically indoors in our room after breakfast. The reason being, Diani is a little bit cold right now. It's like it's a, it's having its own version of winter, <laughs> of cold, rainy season. It's a bit. Actually, no, it's perfect. The weather is perfect for me because it's not too hot. Also, it's not too cold. It's just. The right amount of cold but it's been gloomy it's not been sunny so we decided to stay indoors and do some editing of this video that has just gone up and it's the video of our the vlog of when anyone surprised me for our engagement and thank you guys so much i know you're going to be watching this as well at some point at some point so thank you guys so much for the positive comments the love the support um the love, the support. I'm gonna say that again because emphasis, emphasis on that. We really appreciate it. So, since we are done doing all that, the video is doing okay. It's doing great. We wanna go down for lunch because now it's already lunch time. I, I don't think we're gonna eat. Are you gonna eat, babe? Lunch? Mm -hmm. Did you say lunch? <laughs> he's <laughs> he's so over the food here. He wants to go back to Nairobi. Oh, uh, this is effectively. Am I in the shot? Here we go. Uh, it's kind of like the back end of two weeks. We we came here before, and it's nice. It's nice food. It's fine, but it's it's very repetitive. It's all inclusive, and of course they're gonna repeat the same food over and over. And it's a bit, yeah. You get over it after three days. Let's say so. <laughs> So we know we already know what's gonna be on the menu, and you know it's like it's kind of like high school. You know it's what you're going. It's nice. Yeah. It's nice. It's just you know exactly. It's what it's gonna be. It's an institution. So you like they kind of repeat the same food on the menu. And that's okay if you're gonna stay here for two three days. But a one week a, two weeks. A week. A week's fine. Two well, we weeks. We week. We stayed here a week before and then. Yeah. Probably three days in, I was like, oh, I remember all this stuff. It's the same, <laughs> yeah. it's the same stuff as last time. It's good food though. So maybe if you wanna come over here, and, and also it's just. I didn't realize, but it's only all inclusive, so you can't choose breakfast or dinner or breakfast and dinner and skip. Like it's on when you're booking, it's only all inclusive, the entire hotel. So whatever you pay for includes everything you're gonna do in here. That means drinks, food, room, security pool, everything is inclusive. So maybe you don't have that choice. So if you're not an all-inclusive kind of person, uh, I don't think Lagoon Reef will be the type of place for you. But there's so many options around here that you can go for. That aside, so we're gonna go out there and we're probably not gonna have lunch, but I wanna go try jet skiing. I really, I know it's dangerous. <laughs> hey. What? Are you gonna try jet skiing with me? Uh, yeah, yeah, it sounds, sounds fun. Um, are you gonna drive? 
It doesn't matter. No, nah, no, nah, we're both gonna drive. We're both gonna rent. I'm only messing. We're gonna hire a jet ski and yeah, I'll we'll have a bit of a spin around. We'll have a, a little scoot around on the water. Yeah. You can drive and I can drive. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. I want to try jet skiing and I also want to try. Um, what's the thing where you sit on a little transparent boat? Oh, you wanna you wanna hire one of those kayaks from the plastic. Kayaks, yeah. Oh, it's like a they they call it a glass bottom kayak, but it's basically a plastic see-through kayak, so you can see the water. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, that, that, that's probably gonna be terrifying when you see everything underneath you as you when the sharks come up and try and bite you. What sharks, babe? There's a reef here. This is Indian Ocean. We don't have sharks. Yeah, sure. We we don't. Oh, okay. On Indian Ocean. Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah. Actually, that information is not verified, so don't come for me. What do you guys think? What do you guys know? Do we have uh, sharks here? Because I've never heard of them, ever. But... Do you, no, we don't. Do we? I don't know. It's just... I, I, I had no idea. I thought there was. I don't think there's sharks on it in Indian Ocean. I'm gonna verify that, but you guys tell me as well. Anyway, so yeah, I really wanna try the kayaks. We were supposed to go to Kisite Mpunguti Marine Park um, today or yesterday, but we didn't go, cause we just didn't go. It takes an entire day to do this excursion and I've been there before. And I just don't want to go back there when it's a bit rainy because the last time we were there we got rained on in the middle of the ocean and there's like a little island that looks like Robinson so if you watch our previous video you know where Robinson's island is it's just, it's just literally it's one kilometer or 500 meters it's a high point on the reef yeah uh, and at low tide it's a sandbank so basically you can't see it at a high tide and then low tide you can walk on you it you can walk on it it's, it's Pure Probably, sand. It's yeah, beautiful. Maybe, yeah, maybe a thousand square meters max. It's just it's very small. And it's a very short distance. Maybe like five hundred meters from no one kilometer from the actual coast, right in front of our resort, and it's really really nice. And there's like a little island like that, sand or sand bank as they call them, over there. And what happened is it rained. A storm came over us unexpectedly. And then the tide rose really fast <laughs> and then we were rained on in the middle of a marine park guys there was dolphins all around us I didn't see any other fish apart from the dolphins but you know it was really scary and then it was just like our boat and one other boat that was there on that day we couldn't see any landmass it was so scary I don't want to go back there and that's when I also went snorkeling the same in the same place and this storm came over us when I was snorkeling, and the guy that I was, the guy that we were given, whom we were given, was some guy. He didn't even have like safety gear for himself. So the little floaty, floating thing, the floating wheel, the floater, it's so, it was only one for three of us: the guy, myself, and uh, the other person that we were with, another lady, and we were all so panicked. Are you, are you listening no, to my story? I'm listening, I just put my hand there. Keep going. Okay. <laughs> are you listening to the story though? Yeah. Yeah. So it was the guide and myself and one other person and all of us were hanging on to dear life on this little floater. And we were supposed to, our boat was on the other side. We were going against the waves. It was pretty scary. I thought we were going to die. And the waves were so high up that if the captain of the boat did not know that we were out there, we would have been left. It's just that he knew we were there, so they were they were like coming towards our direction waiting for us. Oh my god, it was so scary, guys. So I I just didn't want to go out there when it's a bit rainy and I don't know when it's gonna rain, so we just didn't go. So I feel like I'm talking too much right now. <laughs> so we're gonna try um the two things that I just told you guys about. And if we do them, we'll definitely film for you guys. And if we don't, we're probably just gonna chill around the pool waiting for our departure tomorrow. But regardless, we're gonna bring you guys along. So, tag along. Oh yeah, one other thing guys. Um, so you see this leaf, what are they called? Lifter Gloss by Maybelline. Guys, I think this is literally one of the best gloss I've ever used in my entire life. Like, this 
is quite pricey but definitely worth it if you're conflicted between should i get it should i not is it worth it this one is definitely worth it the shade that i'm using is in the shade copper number 17 try them i'm using this because it perfectly matches my skin tone so when i put it on my lips it doesn't look that color like just blends it perfectly you want to try them okay bye guys see you in a bit hey guys so remember when i told you guys we we're gonna come jet skiing and kayaking when we were in the room and it wasn't you know we couldn't see what was happening outside yeah that's no more we can't we can't because the weather not the weather the weather is perfect the sea the ocean is just not nice enough for me it's not perfect enough for me to go get jet skiing and kayaking comfortably so it's a no i'm gonna pass on that baby girl Both needs of the us. water to be like glass i need it to be glass. Like glass aesthetically pleasing clear just perfectly still 100% mm -hmm. just glass so that we can just glide out and I it's actually nice agree that way, guys. it's the most enjoyable when it is like that you go and it's just perfect but it is this would be fun still but this would not be fun can you guys see how that like it's so the ocean looks angry babe I can't see <laughs> the ocean looks angry and someone did not carry his own hat so he has to wear my own anyway you guys you guys see the way the ocean is not perfect it looks a bit too angry for <laughs> hot. oh that's too harsh Ooh. it looks a bit too harsh for like for being out there i wouldn't be on a boat right now so no some people like it as you guys can obviously see okay see that boat with a rock on it it's not terrible it's just not perfect it, it's terrible babe it's terrible it's not terrible it's terrible for kayaking what if you go all the way all the way out there okay maybe not but you won't even get far i'm just not doing it it's not perfect enough for me okay so um so that's it we're just gonna take a walk along the beach and find something else to do and next time, bring your own hat. I didn't it to me. <laughs> I mean, I, because I, I worry about you guys. I even stand <laughs> on, oh. on his face. It's only your face that has a tan and your hands. And the rest of your body is just pale. It's pale, babe. What do you have to say for yourself? I have to say, I shouldn't be shamed for the... <laughs> For the, uh, I'm not shaming I shouldn't be shamed for the line of, of uh, latitude or is it longitude latitude that my ancestors <laughs> chose evolved. babe so, let me tell you something let me tell you something let me tell you let something. me tell you something wait they can hear you <laughs> you're right beside the mic guys I just think if you're gonna get a tan at the coast you know get naked and get a tan your entire body and then tan the other side and fry yourself that's how you get tan well that's what i see most of the guys at the resort do they're just wearing speedos yeah and then the what did you say when we walked in please please why does their skin look like that and <laughs> you don't do that to yourself will you aim i'm like no that's why i wear hats <laughs> don't go out in the midday sun <laughs> No, some of them have overdone it, obviously. Yeah. But but most of <laughs> some of them have overdone it. But you know, you can just do it moderately yeah. with sunblock. Look nice. No, you look no, nice what already. What's the point? I'm trying to get my white skin to look brown. It's pointless. I cause myself skin damage. Okay, okay skin fair cancer. point. Oh. Fair point. Fair point, honey. Fair point. Anyway guys, let's have a walk along this very angry, angry, angry oh, ocean see. bee. The sea, she was angry that day. <laughs>
Good morning guys, it's our last day of our stay in Diani, actually we're checking out today, we're going back to Nairobi, I'm actually so excited guys, I am so thrilled actually that I'm going back to Nairobi because I missed Luna, I missed my dog, we really should have brought her, because I saw some dogs here and I was like what, it would have been so cool to have Luna here at the beach but you know we have we should have done prior bookings and all that before we decided that we want to bring luna we decided we want to bring we thought about the idea of bringing luna two days before we traveled to diani so it was just too much to do in you know a sitting or too much to do in a day so we decided not to but yeah i really miss her now it's been a week this is the longest i've stayed away from my baby girl um I'm gonna be so happy to see her otherwise our stay here has been nothing short of nice nothing nothing short of memorable and nice and you know we had a little hiccup here and there but that is to be expected of life um i like that my skin really loves being at the coast look at how glowy i am guys i'm so happy i have i don't even have any make anything on my face apart from sunscreen so that's really how good it is my face my skin likes the humidity i feel so soft and i know at the moment i get to nairobi bang dehydration <laughs> doesn't matter really but yeah i've enjoyed our stay at the coast Ayman is a little bit preoccupied right now but we want to go down for breakfast so we can come back up and pack our stuff go check out by 10 o'clock our flight our flight is at 12 30 uh, I think we have enough time. We have ample time. He is making. No, no, we've got plenty of time. Plenty of time. We do, and I'm already dressed, so someone doesn't have to worry about getting me out the door. Yeah, breakfast. It's good. Yeah, I'm okay. <laughs> Yeah. All right, guys. Um, you know what? I I realized, babe, we haven't shown them the buffet here. We did Not last once. time. Check out last video from a year and a half ago. So identical. <laughs> it's the same food. Yes. But still, I'm going to bring you guys right now. It's just a little bit awkward when you walk around with your camera in the food area. But for you guys, I'm going to do it. Or you're going to do it. Yeah, okay. The sacrifice worth uh, making. I'm going to put the food on the plates. Babe, that's, that's, it, that's how I put the food on the plates. All right, All right, I'm gonna do it for you guys. Yeah. I've been voted in. <laughs> everybody loves chicken samosas. Not everybody. <laughs> I don't like them. Chick, we don't, because you're allergic to chili. <laughs> Potatoes, babe. They look like bananas. They look like my right. like okay. Thank you. Just one? Yeah. No, two. They're good. Yeah. That's it. We have a mini chicken samosa. That's beef mince spaghetti. You pull your hair on the back street. You want one? You know I like it like that. The other girls in the back seat. Me in the front, cause I'm bad.
I'm first class looking like a Barbie All my friends, they really try to warn me But I just wanna know that this with you You're going on we the were, plane, we did babe. We back off the last couple of days because it's just too much food. But uh, now we're, um, yeah, last breakfast. Have a big one. I'm going to go back to Nairobi alive. Don't want to start today. Really? On a one hour flight? It's hectic. It's very stressful, that flight. It's not. Our last flight was nice. Okay. Looks good, eh? <laughs> Looks good, yeah. Bon hey guys, we are coming from <laughs> breakfast and we are ready to go start parking. Should I wait for you? You've got little legs. Have you got little legs, Eamon? No, you just you just did a legal, an illegal maneuver. I did not. What? No one said do you not step off. on the grass. You walked off the path. No one said do not step on the grass, so it's not illegal. You changed the rules to the right. <laughs> I, did did. I did not. Guys, I just walked fast. I walk really fast. She wouldn't let me have I any, walk really she fast. She wouldn't let me have any fruit. <laughs> she wouldn't let me have any fruit at breakfast. Because I, wasn't allowed, I wasn't allowed to have fruit. Did you guys see the food on, on his plate? The, the amount of food. Let me see your shameless face. <laughs> Did you guys see the amount of food sure. on his plate? I chose not to it have fruit. It was my decision. No, no, I told him. I wanted him fruit. I would have no had it. I would have had it. No more food for you. <laughs> Get up there. Oh god. I gotta find this room again and give him, give him a tip. No, he'll come. I think you can leave it in the room. You can leave the tip in the room. They'll find it. You sure? He'll be there over there. Yeah, I'll find him. Okay guys, oh, it's so nice to be back in the AC. My god, it's so hot in the <sighs> I'll tell you who wouldn't like this, Luna with all her fur. We got her trimmed just just for the and then we didn't bring her, the poor thing. I know. We're supposed to drive. He was, she was so happy, she was like, finally I get to go She's somewhere. She's like, I've got my holiday haircut. <laughs> I'm going Goodbye. somewhere. Look, they're packing their bags, they're bringing me with them, and then what do we do? Left her there. Like I told you guys, we're gonna bring her next time. We'll plan better and have ample time to make some and bookings. Truth, she's, not, she's not very good in the car. That's one of she's the deciding factors. She was threatened for ages when we took her back in the vet. Yeah. So you need to do a few uh, shorter trips with her. Yeah. Get her used to the car, and then we'll take her to Diani because there was dogs on the beach. She would, love, she would love it. If we got her a trim, she'd love it. Yeah. She'd be running around, chasing waves. Oh, poor Luna. Spacking at people, you know, yeah. attacking attacking tourists. So, yeah, it's true. What are you doing not coming over saying hello to me? Why would you guys say hello <laughs> Are you afraid of me? me? <laughs> I'll start barking at you. <laughs> That's what she does. That's what she you does come over to her and say hello, she's like, yeah, I love you. You're my best friend. And if, you, if you step back, she just starts barking at you. She's like, like, why don't you like me? I'm What's likeable. your problem? I'll tell you what, I'll give you a problem. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think that's what that's the conversation so it is. I think well, it is? Oh, I'll show you I'll show you. And shouts back in the people. Anyway, are we have you got some stuff to say? I'm I'm high on the sugars from from breakfast. From all the food. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We need a See, looks good even oh, on you. Oh, it looks good on me. See, get that gloss. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Paid presentation. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Let's, let's pack, babe. But wait, there's more. You want to say goodbye? We'll see them in Nairobi? No. Or the airport? At the airport. We'll see, we'll the airport. see you guys at the airport. Bye. Stay in this moment forever So I can hold you in my arms I will carry you on my shoulders as long as I'm able Scatter monsters under your bed Deep and abiding Liking for you is all I need Until my heart gives in Just
missed her, honestly. For real, for real, for real, girl. I missed you for real. <laughs> I know, I know. Come here. <laughs> yeah. So that's probably that's probably gonna be it for this video. Thank you guys for sticking through to the end. And don't forget to subscribe to see more of this cuteness overload from Luna Lu. You happy? Yeah. She's happy. She's very happy. Okay. Happy. Yeah, I'm happy to see you and I didn't know I'd miss her that much. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey Lou. Ow. She's like, oh she misses you because she, you allow her to bite you. She's like, I got my bitey bitey sponge back. Bye guys, we'll see you in our next one. <laughs>